favourite at 290 on the fixed odds, three dollars and forty cents. Here is an interesting horse and picture shot. Hazel Jazz. He is at eleven twenty-two dollars and eighty cents. He just got a little bit keen here in a race that was probably not really run to suit him. He was a horse who was in behind them and probably wanted to go a little bit quicker. But what he will get from that is a lot of a chance to probably go a couple of screws better today you'd imagine if they just turn the screws a little bit with that run under his belt he's had a couple of trials he is a threat in the race if he can uh, jump up to his his ability that has been talked about around hazel jazz at 13 dollars with a fixed odds 11s and two dollars and 80 cents and with the pace being set you'd imagine by the shackler that might be able to help him he might be able to tuck in and be able to be a bit more relaxed and running at least uh, for Hazel Jazz. You've got the seven and yardstick who ran fourth here last uh, two weeks ago and behind It's a Wonder. The six Raj who was beaten into fifth position. Great to see Shelley Houston out there as well taking the ride aboard Raj and let me buy. Never really got into the race here two weeks ago let me buy and he's at 37s and sixes 51s with the bookmakers. First of our features, it is the Pirate Sand, Waikato Open Hurdles, over 3,200 metres, worth $50,000 for his call. Here's George. Thank you, Brendan. As the field continue to load away, the last few to come into line for the first of our two prestige jumping races today, the Pirate Sand, Waikato Hurdle. The last two to come into line now, he's all jazz and a yardstick. Favourite is number four, it's a wonder, at 290, the tote. Stand by for the start. Okay. Gates open, they're off in the Pirate Sand, Waikato Hurdles. And first away was the Shackler, who's going to race towards the lead from C King. Right there, Yardstick, Dan's a lad. And over on the inside is Raj as they, as they arrive at the first of 12. Over they go. It's a wonder with a nice jump has moved into fifth spot. Then Yardstick now sixth, followed back in the field by Let Me Buy. Out a bit deeper is uh, Not A Bad Rooster and he's all jazz back at the tail of the field. They've cleared the second and they head towards the third down by the 900 metres mark on their first occasion. And the leader is Dan's a lad now. Opens up by a length and a half on the Shackler. Three away as they all cleared the uh, third on the journey was C. King. Uh, then followed round by He's All Jazz, improving round on the outside from It's a Wonder. Two links away next is Not a Bad Rooster with Yardstick and the last pair are Raj and Let Me Buy. And they're eight links off the leader as they come down by the 600 metres mark on their first occasion here. The leader is Dan's a lad for Stuart Higgins. Leads by one length from the Shackler. Quite content to sit second up on the outside of the leader. Two and a half away next then is he's all jazz as they come into the straight followed by c king who's uh, fourth over on the inside of it's a wonder as they take the first in the lane on their first occasion back and behind them next is yardstick uh, then came raj with not a bad rooster and let me buy it the next in the lane over they go once again they all made it safely as they come down towards fence or hurdle number six on the journey and dan's a lad just inclined to run his fences down a little but he shows the way as they get, uh, greet the judge now one lap from home six hurdles left to clear and the leader is Dan Zalad from on the inside the Shackler now getting keen and they got away to lead by three lengths from he's all jazz two lengths away it's a wonder three back then to see King followed round next on the outside by not a bad rooster then came let me buy from yardstick and three lengths away Raj is last the field for the pirate sand wake up the hurdles they work out into the back nearing the 1400 meters and there's still only eight lengths first to last it's the Shackler the leader Leads by one and a half from up on the inside. Next is He's All Jazz. Going forward on the outside again, Dan's a lad. Just a length and a half off those. It's a wonder as they clear the first down the back. Beautiful jump by It's a Wonder. And he's almost gone up to make a line of four out in front. Let me buy is poking through on the inside of C. King under his 71 kilos. He's right there as well. Two lengths away, not a bad rooster. Then Yardstick and a further eight lengths away. Raj is last. At the hurdle by the 900 metres mark and the pressure has been applied now. The Shackler from Ezel Jazz still pinching runs along the inside. Let me buy. It's a wonder now moves into third spot. Then let me buy. Followed round on the outside of it next by Denzel Lad. Not a bad rooster. C King. He's under a bit of pressure as they come down to the 600 metres in yardstick and a long gap back to Raj. Up towards a home turn they come. They've got three hurdles to go and 500 metres left to run in the Pirate Sand Waikato hurdles. And it's the Shackler, the leader. 
Leads by two from It's a Wonder. Three lengths away, not a bad rooster. Followed on the inside then by He's All Jazz. Further back then to Sea King. At the third to last, the Shackler first over. It's a Wonder now quickly bounded up alongside. Three lengths away, He's All Jazz. Not a bad rooster and Sea King. Oh, It's a Wonder almost sold the farm and the Shackler's back in front. From It's a Wonder, one to go. The Shackler comes to the last for Aaron Kuru. Leads over from It's a Wonder. Not a bad rooster and Yardstick. It's on the inside, the Shackler. No, it's a wonder, can't pick it up. And the Shackler wins the Pirate Sand Waikato Hurdles. Second over, it's a wonder. He blew it at the second to last. Not a bad rooster and Yardstick were next. Followed over then by C. King. And then Dan's a lad. He's all jazz. Let me by and Raj. And they gave us a great sight. They've all made it around safely. Uh, possibly a fortuitous win to the Shackler. And Aaron Kuru and Paul Nelson, because It's a Wonder looked as though he had him covered, coming towards the second to last, and he almost dislodged rider Will Gordon, and that gave the Shackler the lead again. He came out after the Shackler again, uh, did It's a Wonder. Not a bad roost, has gone a big race, will finish third, yardstick in fourth position. But number two, the Shackler, will take out the Pirates and Waikato Hurdles. It's a wonder came right alongside and was going to ask a pretty big question of the Shackler. Yep. But the name of the game is to jump all fences correctly. He didn't quite jump that second to last fence correctly and nearly lost Will Gordon. He's done a big job to hold on and still run second. The Shackler, who won the Wellington Hurdles last season. First prestigious jumping race for 2018. P. Nelson, A. Kuru. They pick it up with the Shackler. It's a wonderful run second and a big run from the rank outsider in the race and not a bad rooster who was the maiden galloper in the race finishing into third position. Paul Nelson standing by but uh, it sounds like we will have to uh, pass it on. Oh no, here we go, yep. Paul Nelson's here with us now.